Pete, first of all, a great win on Saturday over Coventry Bears. Just talk us through the game from your point of view as a whole and whether if you've noticed anything during the week that you can lay into the lads for this weekend. Yeah, I thought we were a little bit flat against Coventry. You know, we started the game a little bit slow. Um, and you could tell we'd played a couple of games. You know, to play three games in seven days has been a big ask. And you could tell lads were a little bit fatigued. And we you know we're maybe going to start with the, intent, the intensity that we spoke about. Um, but we put some good stuff together, you know, scored some good tries and you know a couple of people stepped up and played well. The, the player that comes to has up did well. Um, you know, but really it was just a matter of getting through that game and, and, and getting the result. I think Coventry had a number of players missing for other reasons as well, you know, which helped us out a little bit. Um, you know, so to go there and get the result, it's just a box ticked and, and you know we're pretty relieved to get that result. You say that the lads were tired, it just shows how fit they are they're playing three games in seven days and working as well yeah, part-time. Yeah, sometimes that's what people forget, you know, these lads are up at five, six in the morning working, you know, 40, 50 hours a week on top of that and uh, recovery-wise it, it takes it out of you. The game against Sheffield were really physical, you know, I thought they really give it to us and the lads put a hell of a lot of effort into that game and then sort of back up, you know, only a few days later, you know, they did really, really well. Um, but like I said, the, the four or five that were freshers up did add something, you know, uh, Jack Brown went through, through a mountain of work in there and, you know, and, and we managed to get the result and get through the game. This week, a uh, long, nice little trip to, to West mm-hmm. Wales. What have you been speaking to the lads about in training this week? Because it's not a game that you can take lightly, is it really? No, none of them are now for us. You know, they're, they're all must-win games for us. You know, we can't slip up again. It, it's just that simple. You know, uh, we've had a bit of a down week. Like I said, the lads are a little bit bumped and bust up. And so I've had some light sessions tonight. Again, there'll be another light session. Uh, make sure they're fresh for the weekend and the trip. Um, but we've just got to make sure we polish our performance, make sure we're clinical, as we were last week, um, and, and get the result again. Because like I said, we can't afford to slip up again the way this league's going. How much of a, of, is it difficult for you as, as coaches, yourself and Rich, to not put that much pressure on the lads because one slip up could see us fall out of the, out of the top six? Yeah, it, it's a difficult one. You don't want to put pressure on, on, on the lads, but they've got to realise that we are, you know, we've put ourselves in a situation. You know, we've slipped up in games where we should have got results and maybe we would be sitting a bit more comfortable now. Um, but we haven't, and we've slipped up. Uh, so we are in a position where we've got to go out in every game. Um, but also, if you look at the season, look at the other teams, there's been a lot of surprises and we just don't know how this league's going to finish. So we're going to make sure we win everything that we can. Uh, and hopefully all the results help us out a little bit as well. It is a vital couple of weeks as well, Whitehaven and, and North Wales coming up after after the trip to West Wales. It's important that we get maximum points coming out of these next three or four games to help us in the, the running to the end of the season, isn't it? Yeah, like I said, every, every game is a, is a must win for us now, it, it's that simple. Um, this game of the weekend and a big game against Whitehaven, which I think we owe them one because I think we underperform at their place. Um, you know, there will be competition for places and, you know, I'll have to jump a bit to, to get that chance. Um, and I think we are in a, in a strong place at the moment. You know, results maybe aren't going our way and we've got to learn from that. Um, but we do feel in a strong place. The lads, you know, are really motivated, really positive and, and really confident, you know, so we're, we're happy the way we're going.